Hey, what's up, YouTube land? Elric Ferris, Editor-in-Chief here at Motherboards.org. Today, we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to show you this new little test rack that we bought. It's the new torture rack. I'll have the camera and zoom in here real quick just to show you what this is. Let me just go ahead and say a couple things, though. It was very easy to put together. It'll support a full-size ATX motherboard. It'll fit any size power supply you need. It was small, long, all the different brands will all fit in this. It's got a very nice power button. I'm going to gyrate this around here so the cameraman can see here. There's a nice power button right on the side, hooks right in your motherboard. It's a one-touch operation thing. Um, as you can see, if I'll spin it around, we'll show the back of it. You can have the full complement of video cards. So if you're using an SLI or Crossfire system, there's enough things here in this back panel for you to go ahead and install that. Um, there's got lots of places around the whole thing for fans. I mean, you could really go fan crazy on here. You can put fans all the way around. In fact, I'll just show you this again on the back side. See here, multiple fans. Fans here and fans all the way around to the other side. Now, just between me and you folks, I think this is a little bit too much because this is an open air system. If you're going to enclose it and make it an enclosure, I could see that being a grand fact. But since this is really an open air test bench, I think these multiple fans are kind of an overkill thing unless you're trying to do some crazy overclocking. And if you were doing that, you'd probably be using liquid or liquid cooling in any case. But anyways, this is a great little system. It's easy to put together, has plenty of room for all your components. You can get into the system very easily, put your hands all in here any way. It'll support multiple hard drives, multiple video cards, any size power supply, and a standard size ATX board. So all in all, I think this is a very elegant, easy to use system. And for $145, it actually comes in at a pretty decent price range. I'm sure some people say, hey, I can just slap down on any static bag and build myself a test system. Sure you can. I can also drive around a beat up Volkswagen and call it a Porsche, but it's not the same. So overall, this new Danger Den Torture Rack is a very solid product. I give it thumbs up, say it's a great thing, and uh, thank my uh, technician, Anthony Reynolds, for going out and buying the thing so we could have it. So peace out. See you folks later.